ladies and gentlemen, we're expecting a call from Bad Bush. <laughs> we're calling Bad Bush because it's the worst Bush impression you've ever heard, combined with the worst jokes you've ever heard, and this may be him on the line. Let's go. Killing Klein, X100, good morning. Killing Klein, Bush on the line. Mr. President, yeah. so nice to talk to you this morning. Nice to talk to you, budget big. Gonna cut expenses. Still looking to cut corners. Yep. Have to do it. Uh, next week we'll be canceling Dan Quayle's subscription to Mad Magazine. That, that's a step <laughs> in the right direction. Taxpayers shouldn't have to pay for it. Doesn't <laughs> even read it. Bad, bad. Comes bad. To it. Doesn't read it. Bad. Doesn't, doesn't read it. That's right. In the garbage. Sure. Not, not going to pay for that. No, no. Simply not going to do it. Right, right, Read right. my lips. Not, not going to do it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so I got other things on our, on our mind regarding it. Oh, wait, hang on a second. My other hotline's ringing. Oh, yes. You know, hang on a second. Hello? Ron, how are you? Good? To, huh? Good, good? Huh? I understand. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you, Ron. Take care. Yeah. Oh, what was that all that about, Mr. President? Uh, that was former President Ronald Reagan. Wow. Ronald Wilson Reagan. What did he want, sir? Gig, uh, just calling me to let me know that the Ayatollah died. Oh, jeez. <laughs> the Ayatollah died a long time ago, Mr. President. <laughs> the problem, ba watch my hand. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. Of course, again. Uh, President Reagan informed me that he's going to be, might, might, might be running for president in 1992. Is that right? Uh -huh. Yeah, well, he says he's always wanted to be president, thinks he'd make a good one. <laughs> All right. Well, Mr. President, I know you're busy and you have to go. You always say you know I'm busy, <laughs> trying to get me off the phone. Mr. President, have a nice day. Not gonna die. Not